live the queen. Welcome back, everybody, to the next episode of Pokemon Platinum Generation Forgotten Run. In the last episode, we um, got lost-ish in Wayward Cave, as well as did a bunch of biking stuff. Now, I have to take on these fellas, and I'm going to remind myself what picnickers often have. Raditas, Lion types, and Vulpixes sometimes. So, I don't think this is the right team, probably. Let's... Let's go with Miss Pants and Clara. I think that'll be a salt. Oh, I could go Melvin. Yeah, let's go with this, because we'll have Fake Out, which will be nice. Ooh, a Pokeball. Go for it, my Pokemon! I'll do my best, too! Go do it, my Pokemon! I'll work hard, too! So it's been a week since I last recorded, because last episode was actually one where I was ahead, so I was like, okay, I'm just gonna record this and the next one side by side. Oh, wow, um... Hmm... Okay, I can f I can stun lock you. Did I ever figure out what this was? I don't think so? Well, I don't know. They've got to be faster than a Chimchar. Ugh. Okay, good. Yeah, because I believe this is special. Oh yeah, we're fine. We're golden. I'm just gonna bug bite the Pachirishu. Because if this doesn't kill, then I don't know anything about the universe. <laughs> anyway, I just finished a four hour stream. Took about a 25, 30 minute break. Ate some lunch, um, made some hot cocoa. Yeah, you can see it, you can see it. Um, and I was like, you know what, I just, I want to play some Pokemon. I've been thinking about it for the last couple of days, and I really want to. Oh, Quick Claw, let's go. So I don't think you're ground. I, I don't know if I figured out what it was and I just forgot. Okay. So it's something that electricity resists. So it could be electricity, it could be... Okay, good. Uh, it could be water. Ooh, that did not do a lot of damage. Um... I thought I bug button. Oh, I'll do that though. Anything to eat? Oh, did we get um, hit with the thing? We must have. Three in a row. Let's go, Clara. You just antsy to beat some Patrician butt cheeks. Please hit Clara. Campers and Picnicker. Oh, oh we lost! Oh, we lost. Yeah, yeah, you did. Ooh! Did you get down to one? You got down to two HP. That's wild. Cloud and Chris, guys. Okay, but I'm still under the assumption that Brielle and Svetlana are close to leveling. You're lower level though, so you'll go first. Wait, isn't Melvin only 19? Yeah, but he's already he's already evolved. Super potion. Okay, let's actually go to Brielle because you could have some rock types. 
I just got through Mount Coronet, but I still got energy to burn. Uh, watch, we're gonna get the one that has my chops, and I'm gonna be like, oh, I could have had Gust. Never mind. Love it. I should look up the weights of Grass Knot just to see when it is what power. Not that I know the weights of Pokemon, but I can estimate. Like, I'm gonna guess Geodude's like 200 pounds. I don't know. Let's Google it in real time. Geodude weight. Geodude weight. You're only 44 pounds? You weigh one pound more than I'm gonna chop your rock. But then Graveler's 232. Well, gets hit. Oh, hello, Nose Bess. Let's do this one. Nose Pass, wait. No, no, not, not, Nose Pass, no. Leveled. I'm so professional. Nose Pass is 218 pounds. How? How are you so much more than Geodude? I don't know. Sunny Day. If they're gonna get solar beam. Also, I believe Sunny Day is what would make this evolution change form, so part of me wants to have it, but. I can't give up growth, that's too big. I'm gonna say no to Sunny Day. And maybe I can learn to run another Pokemon and set up. Wait, does that mean we're gonna evolve? Pokedex coming along me. I'm always doing great. I wish, but that's not important. I'm glad he said I wish. It's some humility. Lately, I've been experimenting with a couple of neat tools. Oats, I'll share with you. Left? Oh, yeah, you want the ver versus secret? Yep, Oats, oh, that's, you know, this is what's, I don't want that. No, I want what's in the other hand. Using that Versus Secret, you can find trainers who want to battle with you again. Oats, what's a Pokétech? Do you have one? Yep, you do. You can have this too, then. Yes! Douse Machine locates unseeable items. The Douse Machine is, just try touching it. It'll alert you if you're an unseeable item on the ground. Try it out now. I think there's something here. That's great. Okay, that's an interesting one. Okay, I can't get up there. Or can I? All right, let's bring in Svetla. Oh, you might be... Are you a youngster or are you a... You're a youngster, aren't you? I wear shorts the whole year. I've got energy to burn. Hey, wear shorts. Youngster Austin. Weasel. Okay, I can handle this. Do, do, do. Come on, I hope you're holding Barry. Oh, that's good. Wow! 
That did some serious damage. Good job, Svetlana. <sighs> Come on, couldn't I have gotten that last time? I wonder if they evolve at 21. I, I really have no idea. Luxio. Going to Brielle. Melvin can do it. I mean, he's actually really strong. I think he's still really strong at this level. Oh, you're the evolved one. Nice. Um, uh, bye. Oh, you're fast. Let's go, Melvin. Wow. I was like, I'm not a bug, a flying type, but. We broke on through to the other side. Sit down, Luxio. Your Lux run out. Hey, level 20, let's go. What's our attack like now? Ooh, plus two and plus two defense. 41. Gligar. Brown. Poison? Either way, it's misleading because it's a ground type, but it's in the sky. That much I know. Okay, good job, Baba Yaga. I couldn't win with just energy. The Lord is evolving, let's go! Look at that powerful queen! Congratulations, your Svetlana evolved into Vespiquin. Power? I thought it'd be like attack order or something, but power gem? That's gonna let them go up against um, flying types. Oh, oh, you have, you have pressure? Also, look at those stats. Where's Melvin? So 41, 48, 32, 52 defense. 50. You're my best defensive Pokemon. Oh, and 70. What's your special attack? Okay, so you're still a physical attacker, but you're not far off, which is good. Okay, that means we're on to Brielle now. Um, ha ha ha! Laughter brings good fortune. Wait, did I have them as pirates or rednecks? I don't know. Kevin. Get it, get it. Got Brielle out, right? Yes. Easy. <laughs> I love how it looks when uh, Magic Leaf hits. The different colors that show up on the side of the enemy. It's just so fun. Oh, Geo, dude. I wonder if they'll have an Onyx or maybe a Graveler. I'd love to have... S Ooh. Throwing them levels. Okay. It's like all the colors it glows. Oh. All the colors it glows before you shoot it seem to show up on that side, though. I don't remember seeing orange, but I'll watch it this time. 21? Nope. Okay. I don't know. Whatever. Either way, Magical Leaf is magical and beautiful. This is Brielle's time to shine. Yes! I was hoping for an Onyx. Should have had a team with nothing but level 20 Onyxes. You're faster than me. I always forget that Onyx is fast since they always come after slow Geodudes. But 
no special defense. Onyx is such a great design. I wish they were better. Braggle Rock has music. Revif. Revive. Revicious. I can do it while moving. Oh, but it doesn't do the wholeness. The wholeness. Uh, you're a fighter? So, Svetlana? Grill's really close to leveling, though. I could do... Um... Leech Seed. Damn, this music. Okay, okay, let's be quick about this. Okay. Battle Girl Helen. Helen High Heels. I'm faster, interesting. I do kind of miss having the um, the absorb line that we had with Badoo, but I'm really excited to use just a little cherry we got a crit. <laughs> do you evolve? I doubt you evolve at 23, maybe 24 or 5. 23 just feels like a really odd level. Oh no. Well, I should be able to two shot it. It's fine. It might detect. Do they have that? Or, um. Yeah, detect is the fighting one. Let's find out. Okay, maybe not. Oh, I kind of thought it'd do a little bit more, but. I don't know how friendly we are at the moment. This might. Took aim. You do not take aim. They have detect. Called it. There is a dark move that bypasses protect and detect, but I'm forgetting what it is. I don't think it's like cheap shot or something like that. Wow. You you gave good experience. Oh yeah, let's do this again. Oops, I'm out of Pokemon. It's okay. Okay. Wait, do we? Oh, that's so cool. We like grab our watch. Um, to probably, you know, heal. God, we have Vespa Gwen. So cool. Svetlana's a true queen now. We need to read her Pokedex entry. By the way. Zesty. Three foot eleven, eighty four pounds. It releases various pheromones to make the grubs of its body do its bidding while fighting foes. So someone said four foot six, and I might have even done it poorly, but four foot six is actually a really normal height for a 10 year old girl. 10 year old girls are typically anywhere between four foot three to four foot 10. So um, Dawn, I believe her name is actually right on, right on it. Guys, that Lana looks Evil, like I did not realize until right now. Watch, I'll I'll go into her thing and show you. Look at those mandibles. Those are nasty, nasty. She's gonna bite your face off. Oh, look at that skill. Mount Cornet. Please don't be dark. But it's not.
Mmm. I think that upsets Pokemon though, like it tastes bad or something. Twenty. Wow. Yeah, lead with Svetlana. Or, you know, lead with a a repel. Oh, am I on it? Hoops. <laughs> Metatite. Uh, Ooh, Revive. 100% sure that's how you pronounce it, by the way. The cheetah. According to one theory, Mount Coronet is where the Sinnoh region began. Okay. In a newly created world, a world where only time flowed and space expanded. There should have been no strife. But what became of that world? Because the human spirit is weak and incomplete, strife has spread. This world is being ruined by it. I find this state of affairs to be deplorable. Okay, that's, um, really nothing? That's, uh, interesting, Vegeta. The dust of stars. Okay, well, we'll break these and see where they, where they take us. Oh, they take us to the exit. I'll murder your face. It's free real estate experience. Well, how far I'll get us, like maybe close to the H of HP. I might be asking for too much. Eh, that was like halfway there. I need surf. Will I remember to come back here? Probably not. That's okay. Okay, that didn't really save us any time <laughs> because rock smashing takes so long. Okay, so there's an item up there. If I beat you, will you share some food with me? I don't think I have any food. Jonathan. Ooh, but you got a good lot. Ooh, 22. I'm guessing over 500 EXP. Oh, I'm glad you missed. Even with your weak stats and stuff, that probably still would have hurt because Rail is not exactly the most full suit. To oh, great. This isn't Razor Leaf, what are you doing? <laughs> Over 500. Love it. We were starved for food and now we're starved for wins or whatever he said, I don't know. Great! Oh. Oh, I can't get up there. Oh! The karate man, karate man's going to pulverize you. I want to fight Pokemon. Why are you attacking a ten-year-old girl with violence? She's only four foot six. Okay, at the same level, we're faster. Very good. Oh, I don't think we. Ooh. Hey, yo, Svetlana! Time to use Gust! Gosh, she looks sick. Oh my god! 
Queen of Beedrills, get him! Pokedex thing. Beehive, okay, so you are a bee. I was like, you kind of waspy to me, but it's okay. I should heal Brielle. Bet you there's an item below me. Betcha. Gahahaha, <laughs> you're just a little tight kid. How are you? How are you supposed to beat a big old man like me? I don't know what their voice is anymore. Robert. Speaking of Robert, Colbert, John Stewart's back in The Daily Show. Nice. Love that guy. He's funny. Lock? I somehow didn't think I was going to try to run away from a trainer battle. Did you just burp in my ear? Damn, you get five. Do you evolve at 24? I'll take two defense. Do you evolve at 24? It's a cricket tune that we have just smashing rocks either way. I'm for it. It's so tiny. Is this where we get the other shallows? The blue one? We get the doof! Downfall is you're not a water type yet, if I remember correctly. Um. Melvin up in here. Aroma lady? Oh, you want to have a battle? I was mean to enter a contest, but beating you won't take long. It's a little rude. Hannah, that even is your real- Ooh, a Roselli. Oh my gosh, they throw flowers up? I want to do that. This is neutral. Don't sting me, bruh. Worth a lot. Combi, uh, you're gonna know. <gasps> Meet your queen. I just realized I'm quad effective against my own kind. <laughs> oh, you're a boy? Look at you. You could have evolved by now if you were a girl. than me. Is Vespiquen one of the rare Pokemon that gets slower when they evolve? Because I know that happens to a few. Oh, you've beaten us. Yeah, I have Aroma Lady Hana. My uh, cousin's name. Aroma Lady, not Hannah. After berries planted, watch the color of soil. If the soil is dark, it means there's plenty of moisture. If the soil is light in color, water it with your spray duck. I'm gonna nab these berries. No, my cousin's name is Hannah. One of them. Rutzbetters. I have multiple cousins. Three? Yeah. For 
get one of them's names, though. I haven't seen her since I was like, I don't know, nine? Berry Master's House, three berries available. Give me the citrus, old man. Everyone seems to call me the Berry Master. I hand out berries daily because I want people to learn how to be wonderful they are. You're just a friend of one. <sighs> Idiot. Are you the forgetful type who forgets where berries are planted? No. Oh, is that so? Then you're okay even if you don't give you this. Oh, give me thing. Give me thing. I feel so kinship with you. You can have this app. Cool. Uh, would you like some mulch? If you're going to grow berries, mulch is good for them. No! This is not Stardew Valley. Sinnoh now! This is it, the one you've all been waiting for. It's time for Sinnoh now, your portal to what's hip and happening in Sinnoh. Here's the first story of the cutting edge of Sinnoh trends. My daddy's a big shot at the TV station, so I get to be on TV. I'll tell you about the nature of Pokemon. Oh, shut up. Shut your pie hole. Can you say something about milk? Okay, let's um try this new one out. That's really cool, and I now have a map. That's more exciting, I now have a map um, on my Poketech. Um. I'm still not sure if we're gonna keep Clara, cause like I still want a certain flying type, and I'd also like um, a Krogunk. I don't know where I can get a Krogunk. You an artist? You and I, let us create a scene, a fantastic tableau of battle. <laughs> I don't know that word, okay, sir? And if any one of you who can comments, it means this, so say the word, okay? Don't just say it means this, and I'll be like, I don't know what you're talking about. Y'all not using timestamps and stuff, like I remember things from a week ago. I appreciate you thinking my memory is that good, but it's not. Ansley, isn't that... Uh-oh. I mean, you can't be that strong. Alright, we should three-shot it. Oh, yeah. Especially if we get another one. Oh, we don't need another one. I mean... Sure? Take my HM move. Sucks for you. Can't unlearn it, brother. I get X scissor at 28 to attack. Magnificent. I am a glow with an inspiration. Is that what he said? I don't actually know. Get him! Wait, what? Don't say a word, just take it. Go to Route 209. Go underground. Listen to the stone pillar. Talk to people underground. I... Wait, you're not in here? Vital item that is needed to keep a stone tower from collapsing. Voices can be heard from it occasionally. 209, okay. Oh, we're close. Wait, is this the Spiritome thing? Hi, lady. If you say her stone city, I only say this. Pokemon go and I'm going into my tail and Pokemon in them. Her stone says a great place. Every year it gets voted the most desirable place to live in Santa. Shut up! I want to live in the Pokemart. Cowboys. I travel a long way to take part in each countish. I 
I'm giving a Pokemon lots of puffin. What the frick's a puffin? I'm confident that we're gonna win our share contest. Contests are interesting, but the ruins of Solochian Town are as well. Sorry, the gate's closed for a while. What? No! Let me go! I went to search for a Pokemon. A Bunnery? Oh, thank goodness that you happened to be there. If it weren't for you, who knows how far my Bunnery would have run. Baby Bunnery, or sorry, Bunnery, Baby Bunnery, back to the Pokeball will you go. I'm Kira, I'm a Pokemon contest judge. Be sure to drop by the contest hall so I can thank you properly. Maybe. You're a trainer, are you? Uh, you got two choices of challenge, either gym or contest, right? I guess. Warm and kind. I have a professor friend, and this is what he told me. If you leave a pair of Pokemon with a daycare, sometimes eggs are found. Or things that are like eggs, anyways. I wonder how my pal Professor Elm... You know Professor Elm? He was always a quiet sort and didn't really stand out. Be mean to him. Did you know they found negative at the daycare and sold the Celestia on town past year? Then let me pass. Did you know they found eggs in the far-off Johto region, too? Punch you in the dick hole. Fisherman? I'm visiting here all the way from Hoenn region. I had been hoping to find a contest hall, but in being new, I lost my way. Fortunately, the local people here uh, very kindly led me to my destination. I was impressed by their kindness and generosity to a complete stranger. Now, may I offer you the courtesy of showing you the cunt? Fine. Ah, please follow me. <laughs> baby looks like an old man. That was an Einstein baby. <laughs> This is Contest Hall. Please do go inside. That's it. You suck. What is this? Church? Go see Arceus. We cannot read the minds of others, which causes us to feel fear and doubt, but to control the aspects of the world beyond our senses is an impossibility. Crap, I think this is church. You know, people and Pokemon join hands, everyone's happy. It makes everyone come together. It could even make the whole world win. Nope. God, this is this is Jesus' place. And there do I see my father, my son, my life. And there do I see nature, Pokemon, the world. Mind and matter. It's not good if one is stronger than the other. Balance is what's needed. That's the key. The art of crafting things fatigues one's spirit. When the spirit is healed, the desire to make something returns. It is such a wonderful cycle. If the strong are able too much, they limit the contributions of others. Strong must show strength. This enables everyone to live together and share responsibility. That one hurt. <clears throat> People are lonely and only natural. It gives me compassion for others. It's what makes me look forward to a better tomorrow. But there are still moments of fondness for the past. Though time can heal some sadness, but not all. There are still words that not everyone can describe. These words are love and joy. I can describe love. Oats. Pokemon people, it's only natural that we're all so very different. Make sure that you never judge a Pokemon and it's weak or strong. You must always look for the good inside of them. That's what counts. Go, 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 Melvin. I used to firestone my Pokemon and it evolved. Well, what Pokemon? Papa, Mama. I can feel the baby stroller getting heavier each and every day. I wonder what kind of Pokemon my child become friends with- I thought she was gonna say what kind of Pokemon my child will become. I didn't read the sign. What is this? Have you got some berries? To make delicious puffins, the key ingredient is a rare berry. And the more cooks- the more cooks you have, the more delicious the puffin. Eating food makes, makes people and Pokemon more energetic and happy. In that sense, we're exactly alike. Hey, right, let's get cooking. Here's my advice on cooking tasty puffins for your Pokemon crew. In the beginning, while it's still a batter, swirl it gently and avoid spillage. When it starts to harden, churn it fast in big circles. At the end, make a wish for it to turn scrumptious and whirl it. Is this something I can feed to my Pokemon to make them happy? If so, it's pants. What kind of flavors do you like? Happily eats anything. Sounds like the real Miss Pants. Hello, uh, 
are here to pay cook berries and alone but puns. Or would you like to cook alone or with other people? Alone! Sorry, you must have a popping case. Yeah, the way I shouldn't do Wi-Fi. In this game, someone will later. I bet that's the gift someone's gonna give me. It's got a neat thing on the top. Hello, I'm with Jubilife TV. May I hit you up for a quick interview? No. Oh, that's too bad. Hate the interview system. Hello, hello, how, how I say do you do? I'm your Pokemon fan club chairman. Indeed, yes, I am. When you wish to treat your Pokemon to a treat, where do I say do you do? I, I say so, and I will. I feed Puffins to my Pokemon. And why I say, what do I do that? Because giving these Puffins is always expressing your love. For example, if I were to give a sweet Puffin to a Pokemon eating, it would become more cute. For example, a spicy Puffin might add to the cutest. In such ways, I say the Puffins make nothing but goodness for Pokemon. Therefore, I declare the Puffin case to be a gift. Thanks, Dad. Okay. I urge you to fill with puffins and be generous to disperse them to your Pokemon. Melvin Pokemon Fan Club. Oh, you're Melvin? It's very friendly towards you. I can tell. <gasps> Miss Pants, how much does she love me? Okay, so apparently, if I go to where they're all floating about. Okay, one. Where's Miss Pants? Good. Pants, come here. One small heart? How do you leave a small heart? You've been with me since the beginning. The OG times. Back in the dark days. Before Melvin. It's very sad before Melvin. Here yeah, at the contest, then we have Amateur Square. Her stone gets visitors from all over and so things are nice and clean. People are all over the world follow Pokemon contests. What should I do? I could capture the whole world. Bet you could. I sure we finds berries and things when you get to Amity Square. Wait, there's no stairs here? You're all dead in a fire. Just saying. I have something for your Pokemon to hold. Take this Shell Bell. Is that the healing one? Shell Bell should be held by Pokemon in battles. The hold regains HP every time it inflicts damage. That was given to me by uh, when I was on vacation, but I already had one. Nice. Is anybody not holding anything? We'll figure it out later. It'll be good for somebody, I'm sure. And again, this is what I really like about these Forgotten Runs. I get to take my time, I get to explore the towns, see stuff that I normally wouldn't. When I take my baby out of the stroller, I see the town in a different way. I notice things like stairs and bumps in the sidewalk. You pooped? Well, buddy. Change your diaper. I put my Versa Seeker through its paces a lot, and I battled this one intriguing trainer over and over using it. She asked me, do you like me? Like, oops. <laughs> hey there, how's it going, trainer? You're, you've been here telling me you're going to challenge gym later. Well, I hate to break it to you, but that's impossible. You're questioning why, and the answer is this. She's not here. Not to worry, though. Uh, she, uh, we know she is at the contest hall. Come, okay, fine. Fantina, alluring, soulful dance. That doesn't tell me anything about the kind of Pokemon she uses. I get to see Pokemon all day long, but there sure are many kinds. How many are there now? Um, at least four. At the Lost Tower, people unburden themselves of unbearable sorrows. You understand what I mean? It is the Lost Tower on Route 209. Troll. <gasps> Somebody give me stuff. Oh my goodness, so many people. Well, now you're a trainer. That makes you both Papa and Mama to your Pokemon. You know you have Pokemon around leads to new discoveries. It's the same for parents and kids. I'm shut. I don't care about your kids. Babies and Pokemon get along perfectly together. When babies take naps, Pokemon go to sleep right next to them. Just don't let them sleep with the Snorlax. When I grow up, I want to become a Pokemon coordinator. Two. 
When I get bigger, I'm going to be a trainer too. You're not going to be a Blitzball? Oh wow, you're a Pokemon trainer? Having lots of Pokemon around is a lot of responsibility, but that also comes with a lot of fun. Facts. My sister makes so much noise, no one even knows. That poor boy! Someone give him attention! Ah, we got a new baby! Yeah, you still have other kids. Pay attention to them. Messed up, especially when they're only like four. Ooh, they need to know that they're. Shut up, they're four. Rotham is ki a kid friendly city, they say, but I disagree. Rotham was friendly to kids, grown ups, and Pokemon too. Okay, that was weird. None of my grandchildren are clamoring for Pokemon of their own. It may be tricky to manage it, but it will brighten up the mood more. Come back kindly in hopes of being treated very kindly in turn, but how could that be a bad thing? No, there are no stairs in this house. It's easier that way. The lack of stairs makes it easy for the little Pokemon to get about. If there's a fire, you're going to die. Okay? Dead. D E D. Dead. It's how it's spelled. Don't even at me, Tony. Mr. Arthur and his spelling. I bet you use spell check. That's right. Calling you out. I bet you use spell check. As you should. It makes things nice and easy. Hiya! Oh, you're a trainer? That means you're using Pokemon boxes. I love meeting end, use end users. Oh, what's up? Why that astonished look? Oh, right. Sorry. There I was running my mouth again. My name is Bebe. You know the PC in boxes? It's the system administrator. I know this about. I know this is out of the blue, but do you want a Pokemon named Eat? Sure. Here you go. Uh oh. He just gives you an Eevee? Kinda cool. Ah! Are we all ready to have some fun? Okay, fine, what fun. Okay. Shall we do some fan something fantastic? What? I, I came here to- what? We're fighting inside the Poker Center? How come the Pokemon come out in confetti? I wanna- Come on, confetti. Is that what you guys are talking about? I can like customize my stuff? I wanna come out of confetti. Why are we fighting in the Pokemon Center? Yay, Miss Pants grew level. Do you evolve at 22? Nope. Or I, I don't know. <laughs> you don't see it there. No, 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 mwah! Okay, she doesn't. Clown's making us a face that's crying while laughing. He finds what we do. We just had a battle in the Pokemon Center. Like, it just feels wrong, you know? Like, this is sacred ground. hurt i don't like it but folks that's gonna be the end of this episode it's a long one but thank you so much for watching do take care of yourselves but until next time i think we'll do the contest on the next one Bye bye for now